Joined here by Marquis Sampson and Marquis, always good to see you. Appreciate you swinging by. Yeah, no problem. You know, we you know we had to say it. I want to talk to Sampson. Good, <laughs> yeah. good to have you come by. Yeah. So, you know, we were just catching up the other day. You know, doing some of those those promo photos. But you know, how's it been going for for you since you know going back to last year? It seems like it's been a crazy you know whirlwind last year. But mm. how kind of you adjusted and the team adjusted to everything? It, it took a while to get adjusted, but I felt like uh, get like a couple of weeks in, we just kind of um, just fell in love with football, you know, it was like, fell back in love with football, it was just football all the time, no matter what we were doing, you know, and that's just kind of how it went. How much do you think it helped, too, you know, going back to 2019, you know, we're coming off the big season, you know, getting program history there with a share of the title, how much do you think that momentum and that history kind of helped keep you guys together through all this? Yeah, it pushed us a lot, actually, because everybody, when we came back, everybody just kind of wanted to get back to that, uh, that championship caliber kind of atmosphere, you know. And so there weren't really that many kind of breaks or like uh, like down periods. Everybody was just kind of uh, ready to go all the time. How much do you think it helped for you too? You know, not being a newcomer to the program, I can only imagine you know, how tough it'd be. Mm-hmm. Say you were you know new recruit coming in, you know during yeah. last year. How nice was it to you know already been in the system? You know, kind of knew your way around everything. Yeah, it was it was really beneficial because I just kind of uh, just kind of hit the ground running. You know, that extra year gave me time to get even in uh, more in shape and. Uh, get it bigger, faster, stronger, stuff like that. How much do you think, too, you know, we talked about this with a lot of the guys, but, you know, the culture on this team, you know, somebody was different this last year. Mm-hmm. How much did it help having that bond with, you know, you guys, you know, getting you through this last year? Because, you know, that's it's tough for anybody, I think. But I think it seemed like you guys stayed close. You know, you kept working out. I saw a lot of you here throughout the summer of last year. Yeah. How much do you think that helped having that closeness to keep you guys together? The year actually helped us bond a lot, you know, with uh, Ryan coming in, being a new guy. It gave us a lot of time to get prepared for the spring, you know, get even more prepared for this summer so in this fall so we're we're ready so you think it was tough at all you know obviously going back again last year you know, you're getting ready for the spring season we're about yeah. ready to roll into it that gets shut down how hard was it not to have you know any spring ball and then you know not have a default season and yeah. then to come out this spring and you know finally get on the on the field and actually put pads on it and do something it was it wasn't it wasn't too tough but you could see like just everybody's kind of football mind took a while to get adjusted and uh just seeing all the moving pieces you know, being back on a football field kind of took a while to get adjusted to, but felt like a couple of days, a week into it, we were all pretty good. So, How much did you enjoy this spring, you know, getting back out there? Yeah. You know, the spring game was great, you know, getting out there. How nice was it to have fans? I mean, how much did you enjoy that whole atmosphere uh, getting out there? A lot, a lot, actually. It felt nice to just have family and friends, you know, back in the stands and playing football. It felt like real football again, so that was pretty nice. You feel yourself, too, you know, moving in more to, you know, kind of a leadership role. You know, you've been around the program, you mm-hmm. know, one of our veteran receivers out there, you know, called on to make big plays. Do you feel like you've kind of taken on, you know, more of a leadership role in this program? Yeah, definitely. That COVID year helped me out a, a lot with adjusting to be a leader, just taking the program in the right direction. So. And how are you looking forward to, you know, this summer? We're already in the end of the mm-hmm. summer, but what are kind of your main plans to work on, you know, this summer to get ready for the fall? Just staying in shape, you know, try and get even, even faster or even stronger than before. This summer is going to be really crucial for all of us to get, you know, even on the same, even more on the same page because we lost that year. So we're just trying to come back. Everybody's going to be here all summer. We're just going to keep working. And last thing, too, how exciting is it? You know, September, right around the corner, mm-hmm. got some football games. I mean, how excited are you to get out there for that first uh, game? Yeah, really excited. It's been itching a lot, you know, trying to get back on that field. So we're just we're just staying here, you know. Everybody's around football all the time. We're working out together, uh, in the weight room together, throwing together, everything. So we're just waiting, you know, waiting for that time to get back on the field. So we're ready. All right, Keith, you know, always great catching up with you. Really appreciate you swinging by. Appreciate your insights, and we look forward to talking to you here more soon. Thanks for stopping by. Yeah, no problem.